Hey, hi everyone. In this particular lecture, we are going to learn about how to use REPL, which is REPL in Node.js. Well, let me tell you that REPL is one of the easiest way to test all the small snippet of code quickly, right? In your terminal, basically. Now, what this REPL stands for? Well, in your REPL, the R stands for read. Read means whenever as a user you input anything that right so in node.js read your input and that's come into this step that is r which means read after that we have e e stands for evaluate well whatever the input that you give to the terminal or the node.js node.js evaluate your input evaluate your input for the result or to check whether the input is valid or not right that's come into your e and then comes to p what is this p well p stands for print so if your input is valid in that particular case your node.js will print the result right and the end l l is loop what this loop means loop means basically when the node.js will give you the particular result right after evaluating your all input and everything it will now wait again for your new input right so it has done the work for your uh, one input you get the result after that now it's waiting that when you uh, again give the input it will again start this process right so that's what the loop mean here right now let's come to the practical part uh, now we will go to the terminal and enter inside the node environment but before that uh, let me show you something like if you uh, press 2 plus 3 here and press enter right you can see i'm not getting anything why because it is just a terminal which cannot give you the result right now let's come out of it and go to the node environment right so for the node environment we just need to write node here node and press enter after pressing enter it has written welcome to node.js version whatever version you are using and then type dot help for more information so it is basically it will give you all the uh, basically all the methods and everything you don't need this in this particular explanation right now after entering inside the node environment now you can execute your code or your input here let me show you how basically repl for a small uh, code in snippet right so that's why we are going to write a small codes or a small input right so let's say 2 plus 3 here so you can see before entering it has evaluated the result now when you press enter it has printed the result right so basically what is happening here when i am writing any user input the node.js is performing the first step that is r which is read it is reading the result sorry input and then comes to the second that is e for the evaluate right in the evaluate it is evaluating the whether the input is correct or not and what should be the result right so that's why we get the like let me show you that 9 dash 9 divided by 3 or 2 right so before entering it has evaluated that the result should be 4.5 and when you click enter you come to the third step that is print so it will print the result as you can see here and after that it comes to the fourth and uh, that was that is loop now what is loop it is again waiting for the input right so i again want to give an input such as 5 plus 6 minus 8 minus 4 minus 3 divided by 7 something like this and when i press enter i get the result right so it is doing what it is evaluating and performing the repl in my terminal right so this is how the mo most important part here is that after writing node in the terminal you get inside the node environment right so make sure that you know this and remember this right so this is all about repl it is one of the basic concept but it is most asked in the interviews so make sure that you uh, just remember everything what is related to repl right so thank you so much for watching goodbye